here it seems like all I'm doing is brushing a horse. Um, that is not entirely what I'm trying to do. He's George is kind of tactile sensitive, and uh, he also, what I've determined, kind of discovered about him is that he also doesn't like it when I walk behind him. And I and I've learned that it's not that I'm walking behind him so much as that he doesn't like to not be able to see me. He has to be able to have ideally both eyes on me at all times. So I'm trying to kind of, on the one hand, I'm desensitizing him to being brushed because that's not natural for him and he does, doesn't does seem to really enjoy it. Um, so I'm, you know, brushing while he's calm um, or while he's kind of moving around. And then as soon as he stops, I give him just a little break. Um, I'm also trying to move around him and have it mean nothing because he is just not real confident. Um, he doesn't really trust me when he can't see me. So, um, so here, for example, I moved to the other side and he, he kind of shifts around. So I just keep going back and forth behind him and there I quit because he was still. And so I try to do a little bit of that every day. Um, so when I'm doing, when I'm grooming a horse like this, my goal is actually not grooming so he's he's actually still kind of dirty he's got quite a bit of spots I could have hit that I didn't but my point is not to clean him my point is for him to get comfortable with the process so here um, I'm working on his feet uh, he this is probably the third time I've picked up his feet he um, has only been trimmed with sedation and uh, so I'm gonna see uh, how much I can teach him um, without him being sedated, and he's handling it pretty well. Uh, but the goal here is just to stay with him if he fights and put the foot down at a moment of relaxation and a moment where he's kind of trusting me and going with me. So when I pick out his feet, um, it's not that there's even anything in his feet. I'm just going through the motions and uh, kind of tapping on it, tapping on the hoof with the hoof pick, Try, so here he's fighting me, by the way. Um, I'm just going to stay with him. Just going to keep with him. And then the second he relaxes, I'm putting it down. So I'm going to do the same on the other side, too. So what I liked about this foot is uh, he was ready for me. He was already rocked. He had his weight rocked off of that foot. Um, so he's he's learning. He's learning to be comfortable and confident with this. So good job, buddy.